much time have you spent on a 450? Uh, just today. Okay. Probably, I don't know, probably 25 minutes. It's a little different. Um, the bike's really good. It's, you know, I'd never rode one before and just came out here. I was like, yeah, I better ride it now before Mitch doesn't let me ever ride one for a while. So, just came out and just playing around. What do you do on uh, between now and the start of Supercross? Have you started riding the Supercross stuff yet or not? Um, my my uh, Supercross bike's not done yet. Um, I'm actually going to go into Pro Circuit today and pick my uh, 250F up and then find out what's going on. We haven't really talked to Mitch about when we're going to start riding and testing and stuff. So hopefully pretty soon. How stoked were you after that, uh, the podium on the, the last national of the season? Um, it was good. Uh, like first moto, I got third, and then second moto, I uh, pulled the whole shot and led like the first eight laps or whatever. And then uh, Grant finally passed me. But, you know, I had fun. It was good. It's good to get a podium. Were you, were you happy with the pace you were doing? Yeah, I think Grant was a little bit faster, but, uh, you know, that was only my third race. It should get better. Yeah. Well, it was good because you avoided all the, the drama out there. Yeah, that was all behind me. <laughs> what are goals for, for next year? Um, hopefully to get some podiums and maybe win a few Supercrosses and, uh, you know, hopefully do top five in the in overall series. Mm -hmm. um, you know East-West? Don't know yet. I really don't know anything. When I'm going to start riding Supercross or nothing, we're going to find out today, hopefully.